Corey here with another live time video. Today's video is hooking up your new Immersion RC Lap RF uh, puck to live time through USB. In order to start this, we're going to have to connect to the puck and issue it a command. Start by going to putty.org and downloading the installer. This is the first page you're going to see. You're going to want to click the uh, link here. And it's going to present you with some options. You're probably going to want to select the 64-bit option. Run it. And walk through the wizard here. Uh, basically, just keep the defaults and go ahead and install it. And let Putty finish installing. And once you're done, the next thing you want to do is actually turn on your puck and plug it into your computer. Open up Device Manager and verify the COM port that it's connecting to. Once you have that, which is in this case COM18, we can open up PuTTY and connect it to COM18. Be sure to select Serial, select COM18, and go ahead and open it up. You're going to start seeing some text being scrolled throughout the terminal. This is what the, pu the puck is sending through the USB cable. Uh, you, what you're going to need to do at this point is you're going to need to type UPP, that's a capital U, lowercase p, lowercase p, type that into the command window and hit enter. You're going to see a little section that says USB data protocol P3. Once that's set, go ahead and turn off and turn back on your puck, open back up putty and reconnect to it. And if everything worked well, you're going to notice that now the output looks more like a bunch of garbage characters. If it's like this, you're all set. This is a one-time deal, and then the puck will be able to communicate to live time through USB going forward forever. So when you're done with this, and you see this confirmation, close that, and now it's time to actually open up live time. Go ahead and log in like normal, and once you're done, go ahead and select the decoder at the top, and make sure your drop-down selection is Immersion RC Lap RF. You'll see here we're already at COM18, go to communication, and it is talking. At this point, you should be able to use it like any other video um, decoder. Uh, feel free to use this. We'll be giving a lot more videos in the future, and thanks for watching.